Hello and welcome to the TES Secondary Maths Resource of the Week 100. Yes, we have reached 100 Resource of the Week video weekly reviews in this present series. And I think this is the third series of these that I've done. Started off five or six years ago as just a blog and then it progressed into videos. And now we've reached 100 episodes of this current series. So thank you for those of you who watch. I think about 70% of the which are direct blood relations of mine. But thank you anyway and for your kind comments. Um, and I wish that I'd planned this, um, but I haven't. It's just pure coincidence that Resource of the Week 100 also ties in with my annual look back at my favourite resources of the year from 2015. Uh, those of you who have been following me for a while now will know that at the start of every year, I like to look back at my favourite resources from the previous year. And what I'm going to be doing from the 1st of January, um, I'm going to be counting down my top 10 favourite resources uh, that have been uploaded to Tesmaths in the year 2015. And I'll be releasing those via Twitter and I'll put them on my blog and so on. Um, but I wanted to give you opportunity here to, to vote for some of your favourite resources that you've used um, in the year 2015 from Tesmaths. Now, these may be resources that have led to some uh, really uh, enjoyable lessons or it may be some that have uh, given you a new way of approaching a topic or even completely changed the way you'll teach um, or just some lessons that your kids have said I really enjoyed doing that and um, so I just want to show you where you can access uh, some of my favorite resources from the year because as I say I've done a resource of the week every week um, of this year and um, the vast majority of them are stored on the new look at Tez blog so if you go to just Tez secondary resources you'll see this link to blog and this is where um, all the kind of resource themed blog posts are written. Now, they're not sorted um, into subjects, but you'll be able to find the TES Maths Resource of the Week one easy enough as you kind of click through. There's, there's loads of them around. So there's one there and there's one there. Um, however, I've also stored them all in hopefully an accessible way on my blog. So if you just Google Mr. Barton and you go to mrbartonmaths.com uh, slash blog, um, you'll see uh, there's loads of them here, but I've also assembled them. If you go to my TES section and the TES Resource of the Week index page, I've tried to make them as friendly as possible here by breaking them down into all the different contents. And then here are all my uh, number resources of the week and all my algebra resource of the week and geometry and data and GCSE revision and post 16 and ideas for all topics and so on. And if you haven't looked at some of these, honestly, they are some of the best resources I've ever seen in my life. And I don't want to kind of subtly influence anybody to, to kind of sway towards some of my favorites, but well, I mean, it's, it's hard to pick out a bad resource from these. So there's a hundred here just waiting for you to have a quick flick through. And if you do spot a resource that you really like or you just remember one that you've used or maybe you've just used it this last week and you think it really should be included in my top 10 resource of the week countdown, then can I ask you, just drop, drop me an email. Um, teachers at mrbartonmaths.com just you can go via my website for that web address or, uh, or just uh, send me a message on Twitter. Just... Uh, just maybe use hashtag resource of the year or something like that or um or to be honest i don't get that many messages anyway so i'll probably spot it but just let me know that you, um if you've uh, seen a resource you really like and just send me the link to it and then i'll consider that for my for my resource of the year uh, kind of countdown and as i say watch out from that from the 1st of january um up until the 10th of january i'll be doing a 10 to 1 countdown for my uh, favorite resource of the year 2015 and then we shall pick up the resource of the year uh, with the resource of the week number 101 in 2016. So um, if you're watching this video just before Christmas um, or some point in the holidays, can I just wish you all a happy, safe and restful uh, festive period. And I will see you back fresh and ready for more resources of the week in the next year. Take care. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. And bye for now.